We've got to be one of the first kids on our block to get a hold of the PSP Go to actually get to see one in person. It's very exciting, although i got to say it's a little bigger than I thought. This analog thing could really wear your arm out. Let's go ahead and start. Hi everybody, welcome to the PlayStation area of E3 2009 here in the West Hall. As you can see, there's a lot of people here, tons and tons of people. I can barely keep my uh, <laughs> line of sight with the camera, but they have a lot of video games here as well. We've got uh, stuff we just saw at the Sony booth, or at the Sony press conference, and now we're going to actually go around and try to play as many of these games as possible in the next one minute. <laughs> Sony's got a remarkable presence this year, showing off some games that don't even come out until next year that you can actually walk up and play. One of the biggest attractions has got to be this incredible display of home. Look at the fun. Look at the excitement. Check out the, the character and level design in, in this incredible home game. I mean, you can see things happening. You can see how much fun this is. Look, oh my god, another person. It's ARJ Lasaka. That's um, unbelievable. I've never seen anything like this. We're going to go see what else we can find, but I think everything's good. Oh, he's walking. You're missing it. All right, he's gone. There was some movement. It was awesome. You missed it, but it was cool. <laughs> you don't know. So we're about to get out of here. We've been checking out the uh, Sony booth for about a day and a half now. <laughs> Pretty much spent all of E3 here at Sony. But you can see there's a lot of stuff going on here. Batman Arkham Asylum, playable. Everyone's playing it. There's a nice line there waiting for, uh, for folks waiting to play it. Uncharted 2 is right over here. They're playing the co-op there. Over there, the multiplayer. Everything that Sony talked about in the press conference seems to be playable and, and out here within reason. Even um, uh, Ratchet & Clank Future, uh, Crack in Time, everyone's been talking about that as well. People are loving the game. But by far, the game that everyone wants to play and the game that we're not going to get to play because of the fact that the line wraps all the way around this place is God of War 3. It is the hit of the show. It is what everyone wants to get their hands on, and it is what Dave and I are most pissed off about that we can't get to play it. But you know what? We're not bitter. Right, Dave? We're not bitter.